hello everyone check this is a tutorial on how to monitor your sound when you are live streaming or in zoom or in facebook messenger or in ms teams meeting or other video conferencing software sometimes people will complain that you have hum you have hiss you have background noise etc and you don't know what you are actually hearing because uh, you don't know what uh, is coming into the mic so i just want to give this tip how to know what is how to monitor in your headphones what is coming into your mic so that if you touch something or you get ground or some hum or hiss you will for example i just pointed my microphone into the fan of my computer and I can hear okay so how can you hear your own uh, this is I hope this works with your hardware but you can look in my screen here I can click this speaker where is the loud speaker here this one speaker right click and then click sound open sound settings and then you can click here the input device properties okay this one you click this device properties and then you can see the microphone you click additional device properties here And then this microphone properties will come out you click listen and click listen to this device it should be checked and then you can choose whatever where do you want the listen the live uh, to live sound into your microphone to come out if you have plenty or multiple different audio devices audio output devices you can choose i just choose the default and choose apply so if i remove this and click apply i cannot hear myself i can only hear myself using obs but if i'm in zoom or in messenger i cannot hear myself i can only hear the people i'm talking to but if i click listen to this device and click apply i can hear myself even if I'm in Zoom or in Messenger or in MS Teams or in uh, whatever video conferencing platform, and when I touch my when I touch the the connector of my headset, it makes sound. So I know that the the people who I'm conferencing with can hear those funny sounds. Okay, if I have background music, I can also hear. If I come near to the fan. I can also know that they are hearing the, my uh, laptop, big laptops fun. So I hope that helps. Uh, there's one thing that you have to know. If you remove the headset, you will get feedback. Because if you are using a laptop, your microphone is in the laptop and your speaker is also in the laptop. I will just show that now. You will get feedback but maybe the feedback suppressor will uh, might catch it and might decrease it and then might try again and so on dynamically i will try it okay okay as you heard that that's the feedback and there are other things you can try if you there are okay so there is some dynamic echo cancellation if you check this one it will be more uh, emphasized so i will try to unplug with this one yeah so those things can happen uh this set this uh, features the uh, depending on your hardware noise suppression if I remove noise suppression and acoustic echo cancellation, that is faster 
but it's noisier if I click noise suppression less noise okay this one it's more accurate this one is I think the buffer so those are the things that are possible in my setup I hope they can help you uh, troubleshoot and understand the routing ro routing routing of audio in your computer and help you monitor what your friends and the teachers and the students are also hearing from you have a nice day everyone keep safe